Hey everyone, Hassan here with another Power Rangers Megaforce review for you today. These are Wave 3 of the Megaforce Hot Wheels cars that they have. These, well, one of them at least, was a huge pain to track down. Uh, so I've done a video review of Wave 1 and Wave 2, and Wave 1 consisted of the Red and Blue Ranger Zords, as well as a special 20th anniversary car. Wave 2 had the Black and Yellow and Robo Knight cars. Wave 3, uh, I believe, had the Blue Ranger again, but it had two new ones. It had the Vrock uh, car, which is right here, so we had a villain car there. Um, and that actually was kind of easy to find. But the Pink Ranger one here, I could not find in stores anywhere. It was very hard to find in stores. Um, we looked and looked and looked, couldn't find it. Most people had trouble with it. Some people had success at Big Lots. I looked at Big Lots, nothing. Um, they had a ton of other ones, but not the Pink Ranger. So I ended up getting it off of eBay. So if you are looking co to collect all of the Hot Wheels cars, the uh, Pink Ranger is going to be the hard one to find. You'll probably end up having to get it on eBay, or if a big, uh, I can't talk, a big lot store near you has one, then you might be lucky there. Uh, otherwise, eBay is your bet. They do have a, a set of all these of the five Ranger cars, but it has Robo Knight instead of Pink uh, at Toys R Us. Uh, anyway, so these are the two cars here that it, that are in Wave Three of the Hot Wheels, and uh, so we will take a look at them as well. So. Uh, Let's stop this little spinning action going on here and um, take a look at the uh, the packaging. Let's see. So, move this aside for a second. Here is uh, Vrock, the packaging for Vrock. So it says Vrock Alien Cyborg there, and uh, that's uh, what he looks like. So... That's probably coming up on uh, on Megaforce, one of his later forms. Uh, looks pretty cool. And I'm glad they they made a little uh, car of Rock. I think he's a he's an interesting villain with a cool design. Um, and as you can see, the back shows the three in Wave Three: the Pink Ranger, Rock, and the Blue Ranger. Um, so there's that. Then we have the uh, Pink Ranger packaging, same kind of thing there, except it says Pink Ranger Phoenix Sword. There it is. Um, I'm not sure why they all say Power Rangers 20 on it. I don't. I can't remember if the other cars said that on there because um, it's. The Megaforce toy, but it does say Megaforce up top, and the back is the same. So, um, yeah, and uh, real quick, in case anybody wanted to see um, the other cars, I'll grab those as well. So, Wave 1 had the red, blue, and the, the 20th anniversary car. Um, then we had Wave 2 <laughs> with the uh, yellow, the Black Ranger, and the Robo Knight. And now we have the Pink Ranger and uh, Vrock. So these are all of the Hot Wheels cars. Uh, actually, there's one other one that comes with some with some other set. It's like a loop, I think, or some other set. It's a, I believe it's a white colored car. It's to celebrate the 20th anniversary, another 20th anniversary car. Um, so in total, well here, there's your, your six Ranger ones, uh, and then the villain and the 20th anniversary car. So you have eight here, but there's a ninth car that is in another set. I'm not planning on getting on that. Um, I just wanted the uh, the Ranger cars for the most part, so I just have these. Um, so pretty cool as a set. Um, these Hot Wheels, I never really planned on getting initially, um, especially when they didn't release the pink one at first, because uh, I want to get the full set, you know? But when they finally decided to release pink, as hard as it was to track down, I was like, all right, I got to get these. And they actually look really cool. I'm, I'm glad that I got them. They look really cool. Um, and the uh, Megaforce Action set... That did come with the the 20th anniversary one <coughs> excuse me um was actually the first uh i was the first person to review that um which was any first the first review of any mega force toy out there i think um so that was kind of fun but uh anyways yeah so here's the uh the pink ranger phoenix sword car it's mostly white it's got your you know your pink on it there nice little see-through pink there you can see the uh, steering wheel you have your uh, mega force sky logo there um and then some blue headlights, but you have gold on the bottom there, gold arrows and um, stuff there. Um, the bottom is all gold as well. And it looks kind of neat. Um, there's This part is kind of grayish. 
I mean, overall, I mean, I like the shiny stuff. I like shiny, if you don't know that already. Uh, but, uh, you know, this car is not too bad. It looks kind of neat, I guess. Uh, nothing too fancy or anything, but uh, it looks kind of neat, especially, oops, and I'm dropping it. Especially with all the other cars next to it, it looks kind of cool to, to have that whole set. Um, this one's actually a really neat design, the one for Vrock, um, I must say, if it will. There we go. Um, yeah, I mean, this looks really interesting. If I had no idea this was related to Vrock, I probably wouldn't have guessed it, because it's kind of out there a little bit. They took some liberties with his uh, design and everything. Um, I guess all they really took was the similar color patterns of blue, um, but even the gold is kind of exaggerated, I guess. I don't think he really has that much gold on him. Um, so, in terms of how close it is to Vrock itself, not really. But uh, not really very close. But it still looks kind of neat overall. You know, I think it's kind of cool to, to have something like that. Um, yeah, so it's interesting. Interesting looking little car. So yeah, overall, I think these are um, two pretty, pretty neat looking Hot Wheels. Uh, if you are going to get the Pink Ranger again, you're going to have to track it down on eBay. Um, but I think, you know, if you're trying to collect the Hot Wheels, if you go for the full set, I think that's when it looks really cool you know especially if i can get uh here's the you know the five main megaforce rangers right here i mean you have all their zords together I, that looks pretty neat you know i think that looks cool to have all of them they each have their own little uh uh what's the word i'm looking for little things that kind of stand out about them like the blue's got that little paint there the metallic paint the the uh the black one, um, I mean, they all kind of like took the, the elements of their Zords, but in car form. So it's, they're really neat designs. I think they actually, um, had some fun with, with making these things. I think it looks cool. And then, you know, you add in the, uh, the Robo Knights and, uh, the 20th anniversary car as well. And, uh, Rock. And you have a, a cool little set. I think overall, these are, are really neat looking. Um, so definitely something to go and track down, I would say. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so yeah, so that's it. So just as a quick little overview for these, I would have to say my personal favorite is the blue one just because I really like, blue is my favorite color and I really like the metallic blue paint, but the Robo Knight one is pretty sweet. Um, actually, most of them are pretty cool. I actually really like what they did with these designs. Um, but I, again, I think that the cool part is seeing them all together as a full set. So if you're going to collect them, there's not too many as you can see. There's only these eight plus that ninth one if you want the other 20th anniversary car um in that I, th I saw the set at toys r us it's it's like another additional um track that you can add on to the set and, and it comes with that car um but uh these look pretty cool so if you guys have any questions or anything post them in the comments below but uh, i think that's about it for the hot wheels i don't foresee them releasing any other ones maybe they will for super mega force and if they do um i might get them you know if they decide to release a full set imagine like a Gokai Galleon like Hot Wheels car like adapted like that. That would be kind of cool to see. I actually, I'm actually wanting them to do that now. That would be pretty neat. Um, so yeah, thumbs up if you agree. If you think there'd be cool to see a Gokai Galleon Hot Wheels, I think that'd be cool for next year for Super Mega Force. Uh, so yeah, that's about it. Uh, stay tuned for lots more reviews coming up from me in the future. And subscribe because please, please subscribe. Uh, I have lots of videos coming and it would be awesome if you would subscribe. That would mean a lot to me. Thanks for watching everybody. See you guys later.